What's up guys, in this video I'll take you through an abs workout with limited equipment to help you strengthen the core and tone the torso. This workout can be done with body weight alone, but if you do have access to a gym, you should have use of the limited equipment you'll see in this video. This is one of my favorite plank variations, of course working abs, but also chest, shoulders, and the muscles around the shoulder girdle. Up on the toes is harder, down on the knees is easier. A good exercise for abs, but also for obliques because of the twisting movement involved. There's a couple of crunch alternatives if you need them. Crunch meaning lower back stays in contact with the floor. We can do this with the feet down or where one knee meets the opposite shoulder. The Boso ball is an effective tool, especially for core training. Here are two exercises with alternatives, just in case you haven't got one. The Boso ball creates instability, which will require more core muscles to work for any movement or hold. This is a side plank variation with the crunch-like motion of the knee towards the elbow and vice versa. Alternatively, it can be done on the floor. This, however, reduces the balance challenge. Using the ball for any crunching movement allows for an extended range of motion. Try this with the feet off the floor to create more instability, once again recruiting more core muscles. And the alternative is just a straightforward classic crunch on the floor. A simple step box with rises provides an opportunity for a makeshift incline bench. Hook your hands into the high end of the incline step anchoring down the upper body. Lift the hips straight up away from the step and down with control. The body weight alternative, hands down to the side, pushing down into the floor. Walkouts are an effective exercise which works several muscles at once. The good thing with this one is you dictate the intensity the further you walk the hands out, the harder it gets. Therefore, the exercise can be made easier simply by shortening the movement. And the other alternative is to go down onto the knees. Last up, using the stability ball for the jackknife. Once again, the ball creates instability, which recruits more core muscles. Roll the ball in towards the body by bringing the knees up into the chest. This is the no equipment alternative. Still effective, works the obliques as well as the abs. Thanks for watching guys. I hope this video was useful. Please check out the playlist on my main channel. Like and subscribe and I'll see you very soon on the next video.